Hello, my beautiful Sagittariuses. Welcome to your love forecast horoscope for what do they secretly want to tell you for August? So my darlings, thank you so much for liking, sharing, subscribing, and thank you to my members. I really appreciate all of your support. All right, also my darlings, uh, if you like a person reading with me, go to my website, jenniferwalkerzen.com, or check out the description box below. Also, the Eye of Zen, this cut deck right here, is available on amazon.com. All the information is in the description box below. All right, so, for my beautiful Sagittarius is what's gonna happen with their, what's happening with their overall romantic love life? Give me three cards for their overall romantic love life. Give me nine cards for what their love interest secretly wants to tell them. Give me three cards of what they need to know about their romantic love life and give me three cards for the likely outcome of them and their love connection. Show me the cards in to see. Show me the cards in need to see. And if you guys like it this way, you want me to continue this way, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. You can do both. Let's jump right in. All right, so let's talk about your overall romantic love life right now, okay? I'm just going to look at the situation here, okay? Uh, we see there is a lot of people that are attracted to you, okay? Aries, Sagittarius, Leo energy. And one or two people in particular are a little bit addicted to you. Um, it looks like there's some options here. Three of Pentacles tells me somebody you may work with or do something creative with. You're around them and it's kind of like you share ideas and you're kind of like, there's some kind of, uh, something of value around the connection also. Um, I feel like uh, this person kind of shows you the bigger picture, you show them the bigger picture. There is some kind of opportunity and passion here with the Ace of Wands energy. Some, It's pretty obvious this opportunity actually with this Ace of Wands energy. And again, we're seeing the Nine of Pentacles energy, so it could be showing somebody that you work with or there's something to do with creative endeavors or money or finances around this situation. Okay. Nines also have to do with desires, and we see an opportunity here, and three could talk about more than one choice or option, but let's get more information here. What's going on with my Sagittarius' overall romantic love life here? What's happening with the romantic love life here? Show me cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need to see. Interesting. So it does look like whatever situation's going on for you guys, it seems like there's a lot of boundaries going on. Like, like the, there's a defensive energy. And like there's concerns about, you know, things of the past and some issues that still have to be resolved from the past. There is a person who wants to resolve some kind of conflict with you. And uh, they're trying to shed some light on the situation because I definitely feel that throughout the cards. It's like, I want to shed light to the to this situation to you. I want to find the silver lining here. I see that there are some obvious signs that I want to bring light to you. I want to send you this text message letter or document. And I just want to be real about the situation. But I am concerned about putting my heart out there. Um, so I am a little bit cautious about this and I may come off a little standoffish, but I do want to resolve this with you because I have love for you. And again, I feel like this person wants to speak a truth to you as well, to bring things into balance. I feel like they may be praying about this or trying to manifest this resolution between you and them, but there were some issues around somebody not being respectful or giving self-respect to someone else, and they weren't listening to their higher self. Um, we see that there is this person that is right there with you. There is a person that's right there with you, and you're thinking about them, and they're, you're hopeful about it, about this message here, and bringing things to light. Yeah, because there's a lot of candles too. So this is someone that there is a passion and energy around it. Because we see it here, we see it there, we see it there. Yeah, there's something of value here. But you're kind of like, I want to be wise in my decision making before I open things up. Okay. So, Three of Pentacles, um, I want to work together, want to build a foundation. I have this opportunity here, but I'm 
focused on my finances. Um, on There's a self-focus going on here, Knight of Pentacles energy. There's an isolation happening with the Knight of Pentacles energy. So let's go down another layer and let's take a look at what your love interest secretly wants to tell you. All right, we got the Five of Swords energy. We got the Sun card energy. We have the Emperor. We have the Five of Pentacles. We have the Judgment card. We have the Magician card. We have the World card energy. We have the Queen of Pentacles and we have the Ace of Pentacles. Wow, so there's, this person's like, there's a lot of stuff that happened here. Oh yeah, a lot of destruction, a lot of chaos. And uh, I don't know, they're like kind of like, I don't know how I made it through. Sagittarius, you make me so happy. And we have such a good time together. And I don't even know where the time goes. But I know there has to be this sense of routine and structure and it has to be done in a certain way it's very calculated so it's like almost like having to be very calculated about the whole thing but i just want to be you know i just want to be free to kind of be happy and joyful and just kind of enjoy the moment i don't want to just you know have all these strict energies around us I just want to just, you know, just enjoy the time with you. Because this is making me feel a little defeated. Um, I just want to just let go and just be happy. Because that's, that's the best time we have with each other when we do stuff spur of the moment. I don't want to build this wall up here. I want to break down this wall. And I want to have a victory here and success in the connection in letting go of control. Okay, so let's keep going here, Sagittarius. What does Sagittarius' love interest, the one they're here for, the one they wanna know about, what does Sagittarius' love interest secretly want to tell Sagittarius? Show me the cards you need to see. Show me the cards you need to see. What does Sagittarius' love interest, the one they're here for, the one they wanna know about, what does Sagittarius' love interest really secretly want to tell Sagittarius? Show me cards you need to see. Show me cards you need to see. Okay, we got the victory card, luck card, end it. Okay. So they're concerned that luck and, and uh, a victory for them has ended somehow. Uh, they're trying to see the long term here. They feel like there's some kind of distance between you and them. Okay. They're at a crossroads. They wanna make the best decision here. And see, they want the happy energy with you and them. They wanna take it back to when you guys were happy. I'm at a loss here, Sagittarius, and I wanna apologize. I want forgiveness. You are my ideal partner. You're my ideal partner, Sagittarius. Before this focus on money and finances. Yeah, we see that you're my thoughts. And I want something to change when it comes to the sad news. Sagittarius, I wanna make the effort and I'm trying to gain some kind of knowledge here. I'm trying to keep this to myself, but I want to cut away these unhealthy things from the past. Sagittarius, I want things to come full circle. I want to travel towards you. I want to have accomplishment in this connection. I really feel that you're very nurturing and supportive and you're there for everyone. You see travel card, movement, travel change. I want to send you some kind of message. There's so much potential for us. Ace of Pentacles energy. I want to give you an offer, a huge offer, a huge potential. I have concerns. I want a commitment to engage your marriage. And I want to send you a letter, message, or document. I want you to know that I see the signs. I feel it in my intuition. Sagittarius, I'm at a crossroads. I want to make the effort here towards this commitment and I, I need to make the best decision, the wisest decision. So when I gain knowledge, I'm going to send you a text message letter, a document. 
I really want positive energy and I want us to be happy and I want to cut away these unhealthy attachments from the past. I do feel like we're, we're spiritually connected. Whether that person's conscious or not, they're saying there's spiritual connections here. I want a victory. I've been thinking about you and I know there's something long term or some kind of long distance situation or I want to travel towards you. I want these changes. I want to end these changes in this text message letter or document or I want this break to change. There's this long distance, long way, long term and a lot of sad news that concerns me. I have this defeated energy and this loss because of travel, movement, or change, or completion here in this, this uh, connection. You make me happy. I want to apologize. I want, to forgive. I want forgiveness. I want a reconciliation. Be patient with me. Be nurturing with me. I know that there is a sense of control or lack of control. You're my ideal partner. I need things in an ideal situation. I want to offer you something. I want to offer you a huge offer, Ace of Pentacles energy. All right, let's see what you need to know, Sagittarius. Seven of Swords, Justice. A truth is coming out. So there, there has been some deceptions here that's gonna be brought to light because of a decision or a sense of justice. You guys are gonna get justice here because of this truth, because of this wisdom here. Um, let's get more information about what you need to know. What does Sagittarius need to know that they don't know that could help them? Show me what you need to see. The cards I need. Two. Okay, the problem is other people. There's been deceptions about other people, or somebody's been lying. The other people have been lying. But something something shock is gonna be shocking and surprising when this truth comes out. There's going to be this control, power move, because someone is focused on this change. There's going to be a there's going to be a flow to a success. So things are going to be flowing towards your success, and you're going to see some big changes. Someone was there was somebody that was lying, Sagittarius, and this lying is going to be brought to light, and you're going to get justice because this truth's coming out. Okay. Let's, uh, let's see uh, the likely outcome here with your connection. Knight of Wands, King of Swords. Look at that, that's very interesting. There's a passionate action that's gonna be taken, so possibly passionate exercise is gonna happen. And through this passionate action or this passionate uh, situation that's gonna happen, this truth is gonna come out and then someone's gonna defend their position. You have the higher ground, you're gonna win this. You're gonna be able to beat this situation. You're gonna win your situation, you have the higher ground here. Knight saying there's an action and wisdom because of thinking and contemplating here. Wow. Okay, let me get you some advice. Can I have some advice for my Sagittarius for the highest best good for the romantic love life, please? Can I have some advice for my Sagittarius for the Romantic love life for the highest best good. Show me the cards I need to see. Show me the cards I need. Two. Two. See. When the soul is ready to spread its wings, it goes through a deep cleansing, a preparation for the new. Like the phoenix that is baptized through the celestial fire to be born anew, you are going through such a phase of heavenly purification and preparation initiation. Soon after, you will enjoy greater spiritual peace, divine power, and advancement on your divine life path. Wow. You guys, this situation was a bad situation, and it wasn't all your fault here, and it's going to come to light, and you're going to rise from the ashes here, and you're going to beat this situation. There is a situation in your life that is about to reveal itself to you with greater clarity. Just like sand shifting, the picture will be seen clearer and quite different to you and how it once appeared to you. 
This clarity will bring you great relief and confirmation of your intuition. Be patient and allow the revelation to come to you at the perfect time. What did I say? What did I say, guys? Oh my goodness. Congratulations, Sagittarius. All right, my darlings, I love you guys so much. If you guys like that, hit that like button. Let me know in the comments below. I'll see you guys another day or two. There's multiple readings you guys to go check out right now. There's the monthly is for July. There's the weeklies, which is the day to day and the overall. They're true feelings for you. Uh, the next six months, the next three months, all up and available for you guys to watch right now. I love you guys so much, and I will see you guys soon.